With his own version of the classic Cosmo cover happening on his runway, Victor Alfaro's spring summer collection had all the elements in place for a stylish take on 70s glam. There was a sort of a jet set influence from the 70s, but updated a little more. Yeah, it's just the elements of the clothing. You tone down the proportions of it, the elements, you have to make them a little more. I mean, if it's a hat, the hat has to be a little more current. The makeup has to be a little more current. The shoes, I mean, you take those elements and put them together. It's, it's, it was complicated, actually. Well, I believe in combining fabrics that are sort of year-round and, and, you know, just don't have those sort of rules to to say, well, this is spring, this is summer. I mean, that, it's there's definitely spring look to it by the colorations, but, yeah, there's a lot of wools in it. But, you know, women wear wool year-round. The prints, um, how are there? Do you develop those? Yeah, everything was developed. I went to the archives of the Etro company in Milan, and we went through archives, and I had very specific ideas as to what kinds of prints I wanted to do. And, that's what I did. I mean, there have been a lot of really ugly prints around this season, and he did them with restraint and with great sophistication. Victor is, as far as I'm concerned, one of the best American designers. Each season he's grown, I think the power is in its simplicity and cut. His pants are cut beautifully like nobody else's. And uh, the kid's a genius.